Alrighty, I'm back. Oh, okay. Sorry, I'm like fucking steam. I'm fucking hot as shit right now because of the, the fucking heat. And I'm like trying to like keep my fucking cool and shit, and it's not it's not easy. Let me be real. This place is not only fucking has no AC, but it's over insulated, so it's fucking incredibly fucking hard to keep uh, myself cool. So my body is just like, Ugh, uh, so I'm just like, yeah, all right, whatever. Let's 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 focus. Let's focus. So hopefully, hopefully I don't like pass the fuck out because of how hot it is. How the fuck do you not build a place with AC is beyond me, but fuck it. I don't know. This place is a fucking shithole. I've been saying it for about almost two years now, but yeah, hopefully soon I'll be able to leave and fucking buy a house or something. We'll see. Eh. Anyway, so today we're going to do some daily dead selves. Do I need to say anything else? No. Oh, oh wow, I didn't even, I didn't even fucking, there we go, there we go, ah. See, I'm not even prepared, I, I, I fucking stumbled into, prepared, but I'm, I'm, clearly not. Anyway. Oh, chat, I'm gonna drag your happy asses over here. Drag you against your will. Oh, by the way, I managed to format my, uh, my hack switch, or my, I'm sorry, my, my band in a hack switch, by the way. I was able to. You just gotta disconnect your forehead. Anyway. Ugh. I'm probably only gonna do, like, maybe a round of this because, um, I really want to play Legends right now. <laughs> I didn't really want to play this. I, I kind of just, I'm forcing it in because, you know, I kind of decided, you know what, let's just make it a weekly thing. <laughs> Where I do this at least once a week, the once a week, but yeah. Hmm. So chat, did I tell did I tell you guys um that I found a human that that uh, one of my detainees found a human tooth in their food this weekend? Yeah. So basically, what happened was um. I, we don't. First off, let me clarify something. I, we don't even know how the fuck this thing got here. Um, <laughs> we really don't fucking know. Um, because the thing is, is like, none of the kitchen workers had. Uh, none of the kitchen workers lost teeth. So we're trying to figure out, like, hey, how the who <laughs> whose tooth is this? Um. But yeah, one of our detainees was eating their meat, their lunch, and um, I guess apparently uh, he found a fucking tooth in his fucking food. And I thought he was, I thought he was joking with me at first, and then I was like, all right, well, let me go in and like let me verify this just in case. You know, I get paid by the hour. I really don't fucking care, honestly, if my time is wasted or not. It's not like I'm being paid enough anyway. <laughs> so I I'm really not. But, uh, well, I'm not being paid for the amount of overworking I do. So, uh, but, like, so I went in there and, uh, I checked. And, uh, yeah, he had a fuck, there was a human tooth in his food. And he was telling me, like, yeah, I was eating my food and I felt something in my mouth. And I pulled it out. And, uh, I I'm looking at it. I'm just like, how the, what, am what am I supposed to do with this? I contact, I contact, uh, my lieutenant, right? And my lieutenant's just like, I don't fucking know. <laughs> I'm like, oh, okay, cool. Cool, alright, well, um, I don't know what to fucking do with this. So you know what I did? I gave it to the other corporal, and I was like, here, you, I, I don't know what to do with this, you figure it out. And he's like, I don't know what the fuck to do with it. So you know what he did, chat? He took it home with him. He took it home with him. So this this fucking dude has a uh, has a human tooth with him. I I wish I was fucking joking. I I'm not, unfortunately. <sighs> so kind of disgusting and weird, especially if you don't know where it came from. 
You know what though? We we were trying to figure it out. I even asked the detainees in there to open their mouths, and it wasn't theirs apparently. I mean, in all truth, truth be told, you can't really know because, like, well, for <laughs> first hut. Well, first off, you can't really know. Uh, because, like, most of them don't have teeth to begin with because drugs. But, uh... <laughs> so it's, like, really hard to tell whose tooth is who. So he said it wasn't his, and I'm gonna believe him. Uh, but the thing is, is the, the kitchen workers didn't have any... Didn't lose any teeth either, so I'm just like, well, what the fuck? Like... You know, it was it was weird. It was fucking weird. I'm like, what the fuck's going on here? I don't know. We never figured it out, by the way. And to this day, we're still trying to figure out who 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 ha whose tooth it is. And it's really, I don't think it's anyone. I don't think it's anyone in the facility. Part of me wants to believe that it's a it's someone in, in the factories that makes their that process their food. I really genuinely feel like think that's what it is. Cause like how the fuck uh, like no I'm dead at uh, chat. I'm serious though. How the fuck do you not not like know that like oh shit I lost a tooth but I don't know where it is. The only explanation to that is um factory worker. So. Matter of fact, the, the fucking medical staff couldn't even verify it, apparently. They're, they're so fucking brain dead over there. I don't know how you could call these fucking people medical staff if they can't verify what the fuck a tooth is. But, um, you know, you went to school for the to study a human, a human anatomy and medical shit. You should probably be very well aware of what the fuck a, a fucking human tooth is, right? But apparently not. But, um, I guess not. Yeah, they didn't even know if it was a fucking tooth. And I'm like looking at them, I'm like, that's a fucking tooth. Well, we don't, I don't know that. I feel like this bitch, I feel like this bitch doesn't know what the fuck her job entails. Like, she's been fake, I feel like she's been low-key faking it the entire time. <laughs> because, like, other medical staff have always complained about this one person, too. And I'm just like, yeah, like, you should know that this might be a fucking tooth. Well, I don't know, we can't verify it. In other words, you just don't want to fucking do your job. Which I respect. I, I ain't gonna lie. I don't want to fucking do my job either. Fuck my job. I hate it. But, um... In all truth, like... You should know what the fuck a tooth looks like. <laughs> I, I don't know. We never figured it out. We don't know whose tooth it is. I, I fucking don't care enough. Truth be told. But somehow it's gonna be pinned down to the to the, to the officers, and it's gonna be like, well now you officers gotta do even more work. Okay, go fuck yourself. I ain't telling them to do shit. <laughs> Motherfuckers, they get paid less than me, and I'm and I'm hurting them for money because of my this fucking job underpays. It, like it's fucking amazing how fucking uh, like psychopathically abusive like uh. This, the, the working as a correctional officer is it, it's fucking insane I could never I will never fucking recommend this job ever to anyone it just I won't it's a fucking like it's psychopathically insane how like it's it's insane how fucking like they they're completely okay with abusing the fucking overworking their uh, their people fucking insane I could never fucking recommend it Anyway. Did you ever get your taxes done? No. No, apparently I'm missing a few documents and they're like, well, we could do them, but no, we can only do as much as we can. I'm like, can't you just like fucking not do my stocks and my crypto? <laughs> no, we need the 1099. Oh my fucking God. I should have just shut the fuck up. Uh. Oh, I'm sorry, the heat is fucking killing me right now.
Let me, what would be a good state for you to live in if you can't stand the heat? Honestly? No state in the United States? I'd probably move out of country. <laughs> like, part of me thinks if I ever do make it, like, like, make enough money, I'd probably leave state, leave the states completely. It's just not worth my time living here anymore. Oh yeah, I'd probably live somewhere closer up north, or I guess closer down the Antarctica, huh? Anyway. Apparently my opinion about uh, Sriracha is uh, very unfavorable, according to chat in the community. Uh, apparently uh, I'm wrong, and my opinion is shitty. Um, I I'm just gonna sit there and say, uh, Esmeralda is better uh, than fucking Sriracha. Will forever be better than Sriracha, and uh, you know, uh, what's new about my shitty opinions? I will admit though, that that highlight is probably my favorite highlight now. It really is. It genuinely, I, I like, hands down, is my favorite highlight. Oh, what the hell is this about? Oh, it's a store. Never mind. I was gonna say. I was like, wait a minute. No, it's a store. It's a store. Um, yeah, fuck it. Come on. Come on. Uh... No. Oh, come on. Don't, uh, I, I really... I don't know why, but like, anytime I fucking start streaming and it's like super fucking warm... Alright, uh, my breathing gets fucking shallow. I, I hate this. I fucking hate this. I was like, I just started this stream, motherfuckers. Come on. It's just, it's way too hot. I don't know why. I honestly, it, it's, oh fuck, it's driving me crazy. How fucking ob obnoxiously hot it is lately. Oh, I can't stand it. The worst part is, is that because my place doesn't have AC, I, I'm fucked. <laughs> why don't you just get a different apartment? Um, well, for one, Roswell is not pet friendly at all. None of the landlords or tenants. None of the landlords here are actually very pet friendly and they don't negotiate very well with pets, which is fucking ridiculous, first off. Um, you know, and when one fucking uh, company owns like 90% of the fucking rental uh, real estate, rental uh, properties, it's like, well, fuck. And then the ones that do are so overpriced that um, it's just easier to buy. It's cheaper and easier to buy a house. So, 
I, I would just rather buy a fucking house. And if I buy a house, it's under my fucking terms. So, like, I actually have complete control over it. So, I look at it that way as well. I was gonna say, you didn't do the Esmeralda voice whatsoever. So it has to be something else. Yeah, it's, um, it's called, it's called, oh my god, really? I can't save myself. Yeah, it's called, uh, my body hates the heat. Your body hates the heat. Why do you live in a desert? Do you think I have a choice? Did you think I have a choice? Does it matter? <laughs> no, I didn't actually. I wish I did, but I don't know. Again, I really do want to leave uh, the desert, truth be told. That or at least I want to leave New Mexico. I don't fucking like New Mexico. I don't. I fucking despise the state. There we go. Um, yeah, no point. There's no point. <laughs> Where would you live then? I don't know, probably somewhere back up in the East Coast. Again, I'm not very much a big, um... I'm not a big small town person. I'm really not. I, I love the city. Uh, I do. Would you live in LA? Fuck no. Fuck LA. Fuck California. First off, fuck California in general. Like, I would never live in a shithole like that. A <laughs> fucking absolute fucking disgrace of a fucking state, first off. But, um, second off, like, um, no, I would never fucking, I wouldn't even fucking touch California. Ever. Let alone live there. Like, God, you must think very low of me if I, you think I'm gonna fucking live in fucking California. A fucking disgusting ass fucking state. Anyway, um, no, I'd actually live in New York. I really do like the idea. I, I really do miss living in New York. And I'm, I probably wouldn't live in the city. Maybe. You know what? No. If I did have the option, I probably would. Not for like ever though. I'd probably live there for a brief amount of time. And then I'd probably move up somewhere like Albany or Buffalo. I don't know. I just, I really miss the East Coast. I do. I genuinely, I don't fucking fit well in this stupid fucking state. I really don't. And in all truth, it's like, okay, like, yeah, I get along with a lot of the people here. But like, you know, I, I don't like, first off, I don't like the small town vibe. I fucking hate it. I am not a small town person. Um, But second off, like, I don't fucking like. Yeah, for context, I grew up in this fucking town as a kid a while ago, right? I don't like having to work at where I work and know that all my childhood friends are in that jail as as detainees. And then them trying to fucking piece together who I am. Which this has happened before, by the way. Uh, I, they haven't caught on to it yet. Thankfully, they have not caught on to it. But, uh... It, it's just, it's just, I don't, I don't like, I don't like that. So...
I don't know. But the plan is eventually that I will be, like, suppose I will be moving soon. But, unfortunately, that plan doesn't include me moving, um, out of the state yet. I wish it did, but, you know. I think it's gonna either happen to be until, it, it, until I get my degree or, like... Either I get my degree, or I'm going to have to, like, or something happens with this shit. It's one of those two outcomes. If you were a big YouTuber, or content creator, or streamer, what? how would you respond to the whole situation? Uh, very reluctant. Ah, uh, contrary to belief, I don't really like the idea. Of being a, a, a full-time content creator um and the only reason i don't really like the idea but i know that if i keep doing this enough it will probably happen realistically it might but i don't but it wouldn't happen right away right i put on a lot of effort and time into my community in my streams so you know eventually the fruits of my labor will be ripe enough to where i am gonna get to that point i know this I know this to be a, a fucking true fact, it's just that it's not going to happen right away, you know? And I don't expect it to ever happen right away, first off. But the reality is, is that, um... I don't really like the idea. You know, I, I, I... And the only reason is, is because I get really, um... I get nervous with the idea, especially when it comes to, uh... Especially when it comes to the whole, I, the, the whole, like, okay, well, now I'm self-employed, and now I'm famous, and, oh, fuck. I don't, I don't like, I, I don't know. Not really a big, I'm not really a big fan of the, of the whole, I get the attentions on me type guy. I'm not, truth be told. I find that hard to believe. I feel like you're the opposite. Well, I mean, yeah. I mean, so a lot of people think I, I, you know, I am very much an attention whore. Um, but in all honesty, um, I am an attention whore, but I don't like the attention. You know. You know, I've said it before, I do like, I like how small my community is, but I, you know, I know eventually that the fruits of my labor are going to get to that point. You know, like I said, I put a lot of effort into my shit, you know. Um, and that's just by nature of who I am. I just, I, I'm very hardworking, you know, I, I'm very passionate and hardworking at what I do. So it's just, I know eventually it's going to get down to it, that it will get to that point. And if it ever does, um, it's going to be very nerve wracking for me. I, I know that. But anyway, uh, the point of what I was saying is, was like, I know eventually it would, it will get to that, down to that point. If the college shit does, if I don't like, if I don't get comfortable with a nice, comfortable job within my degree, I'm. That, that's probably what's going to end up happening. I don't like the idea, but I, you know, it's what it is. Holy fucking shit, dude! I am like. What's over here? Hey, you there. Oh, it's you. You sound tired. I'm a little tired, yes. Been abandoned here for some time.
Oh, come on. All right, well, now we're going to go do this. Good. I don't even think I have I don't even think I have the proper equipment to do this, but we'll see. Okay, we'll do this. All right, here we go. Come the fuck up. Somehow fucking doing this. Oh, come on. Oh, good shot, dude. Fuck yeah. I was actually really good. Get rid of this. I'm pretty. I'm good with. I am good without this. Ammo. Oh, is that um? I'm trying to think. Is that what I think it is? Blueprint for ammo. Is that what I think it is? Because I can't remember. Is it? Does that double? Is it that doubles it? Oh my god, that's good for the quick bow. Because it makes basically makes the quick bow near infinite. Which is fucking phenomenal. Yes it is! Oh good! I need that. I fucking definitely need that. Actually, you know what? I haven't been to the Stilt Village in a minute. Truth be told, I haven't been here in a fucking minute. So we're going to do this one real quick. Hmm. Boom. Bro, <laughs> uh, I remember why. I remember why. I don't like this area. Ugh. Fuck.
All right. What's up, Jan? Why are you here? <laughs> Go home. Stay far away. Before I scream bussy again. <laughs> equipment. I wonder what it's doing here. Almost sure it's harmless to swallow one of these things. I am at home, sir. Okay, well then go get off the stream. <laughs> I didn't ask for your presence to be on my channel. You kind of just forced your way in it rudely and like, <laughs> uh, you know. Imagine, imagine if one day, like, I fucking, like, get so fucking annoyed <laughs> with her, <laughs> with Jan, and then I'm like, you know what, fuck this chick, I'm done. <laughs> I just ban her straight up. Personal, for those who are wondering, Jan is a personal friend of mine. Um, I joke with her about this all the time. Even though part of me is like, not joking because I don't like it when my coworkers and slash friends are on my stream because like I don't need bullshit because if I piss off the wrong person in my friend group at work I end up fucking putting myself at jeopardy so I don't like it <laughs> why I really fucking despise when people like Personal, personal people are like, oh yeah, um, well now I want to be on your stream. Well, I don't want you to be on my stream. <laughs> because you're work related. It's like, it kind of it is like half joking though. It is. Kind of it is half joking. Whatever then, I'll leave. Okay, bye. I'll see you at work. Rude. <laughs> Fucking rude. Apparently my college wants me to do a virtual uh, financial profile for a $20 Amazon gift card. Are you interested in meeting with us? My college wants to invite me to, to earn an Amazon gift card. But why though? I don't even have- <laughs> I don't even have a webcam. Alright, I'll tell you what. Uh... Look at me go! Alright. That was a good warm-up. 